In this video, Kinsley and I are going to show you how to test the four ligaments in the knee. The first is going to be the anterior drawer test. So what we're going to do is bend her knee to about 90 degrees right here. I'm going to take my hands, come behind her upper calf area, take my thumbs, put them right here on the front of her shin bone, the tibia, and I'm pulling forwards. And I'm pulling forwards and I'm trying to see if there's any slack. If this tibia bone tries to translate or move forwards, that would be a positive anterior drawer test which would indicate the ACL ligament is damaged. The next is gonna be the posterior drawer test. So in the same position, what I'm gonna do is take my thumbs or just kind of wrap my hands around the tibia just below the knee joint here and I'm pushing straight back down. So I'm gonna push down, pushing that, and then again, feeling for slack. If I feel any slack, she may report pain. That would be positive for a posterior drawer test, which would indicate pathology of the PCL or posterior cruciate ligament. Now we're going to straighten out her knee out all the way into full extension if she can go down to full extension and we're going to test for the LCL or lateral collateral ligament on the outside of the knee and then the MCL, the ligament on the inside of the knee, also known as the medial collateral ligament. So what I'm going to do is just take my hand like this. I'm going to go just above her knee joint here. I'm pushing on her femur away from me. I have my other hand down here in her lower leg just above her ankle joint and I'm pulling that hand to me. So I'm kind of doing this. So what I'm going to do is stress that, put a pretty good bit of force there. I'm trying to see if I feel slack on the outside here. Also, she reports pain with this movement. And then I'm going to bend her knee to about 30 to 40 degrees, and I'm going to repeat that again the same way. So I do this both at about 30 to 40 degrees of knee flexion as well as the knee in full extension. And now we're going to check for the MCL ligament, so on the inside here. Now for the camera purposes, I'm going to stand on this side just so you can see. So my hands are just a little backwards from what I would be doing. I'm going to go on the outside of her thigh, just above the knee. I'm pulling this hand towards me. And at the bottom, I'm pushing that hand away from me. Remember, I'm just above the knee joint here or the ankle joint. And I'm pushing out here. So I'm pulling. I'm trying to gap this on the inside, stress this MCL ligament. And if I feel slack there, again, she may report pain, then that would be a positive uh, valgus stress test for the MCL ligament. Hope this video helps to give you an idea of a few tests that you can do to check for knee pathology related to the ACL, MCL, PCL, and LCL. Thanks so much for watching.